a guy who had just three offers coming out of high school, Creighton, Northern Arizona, and Wisconsin Green Bay, Kyle Korver sure has come a long way. I recently had a chance to visit with the Hawks forward who told me his game, his jumper, is all about consistency and finding a rhythm. And for more than 100 straight games, he's been able to do exactly that from beyond the arc. Thousands of players have put on an NBA uniform and walked from the locker room to midcourt. I just love doing it, man. I love being out in the court by myself shooting. But of all those who have been on the court, no one has been more consistent from three-point land than Hawks forward Kyle Korver. Kyle Korver, three-pointer. Kyle Korver just simply, if you get him any kind of a look at all, Korver's going to knock it down. Just Korver to... knew from an early age that if he wanted to make it in the NBA, he had to shoot. We had a hoop in the backyard. And, uh, I, you know, I think the neighbors at first, they'd get upset, you know, the ball bouncing late at night, but eventually they got used to it. And, uh, yeah, and it's just, you know, something I've always loved to do. The love of shooting runs deep in the Corver family tree. His three brothers all played or are playing Division I basketball. His father and four uncles played D3 hoops as did his mother, Lane, who could be the biggest gunner in the group. Mom played in high school and then a couple years in college. She actually, she scored 74 points in a game in high school. She, uh, she averaged like 43. Corver's career NBA average, oh, some 33 points below mom's, but you know Lane respects that nearly 60% of her son's points have come from beyond the arc. I, I think the goal every day for me is, as a shooter, you know, it's, it's my job to be a shooter, is to, is to find that kind of happy spot every day, whether it's in practice or before the game or whatever it is. Like you wanna, I don't really try to get to a certain number of shots every day. I try to get to a certain rhythm and feeling every day. Um, and so maybe that's 20 shots, maybe that's 500 shots, I don't know. Um, but like every day you wanna kind of find that, find that happy spot. With the help of Google Glass, we went looking for that happy spot on the floor. You have a favorite spot on the floor? Um, I kind of like threes in these areas right here. Corners are good too. I like the corners. Anywhere behind three-point lines, pretty. I like them all. And when you shoot from up there, what are you looking at? Are you looking at front rim, back rim? My mom told me when I was young, if you look at the front of the rim, you hit the back of the rim. That's it, huh? You look at the back of the rim, you hit the back of the rim. If you look just over the front of the rim, the ball goes swish. For more than 100 consecutive games, Corver has seen at least one three-pointer go swish. Kicks it there out. There it is. Bingo. Got it. Kyle Corver sets the new NBA record. On December 6th, Corver passed Dana Barros for the number one spot on the NBA's all-time list of consecutive games with at least one three. And during that run, there were some nervous moments. You try not to let it, you know, impact your play. And, you know, you, I just want to play good team basketball. But anytime you have a chance to be a part of a record in the NBA, like, you go for it, right? Like, come on. This is, the NBA is the best of the best. It's been going on for how many years? Like, if you have an opportunity to be a part of something, like, you go for it. At the same time, like I said, I do want to just jack up a bunch of shots. And, you know, I want to be efficient. So it was like this tension in my mind that, you know, you kind of battle. It was always nice when you made a three in the first quarter. No, it's definitely something cool. You know, I, um, you try to keep it going. But I think someday, for sure, like you look back, and it'll be it'll be a cool thing. There it is. Bingo. Got it. Free sound, isn't it? It's a good feeling. It's a good sound. All day. <laughs> 